Well, uh, what's up guys? Good morning and welcome. Today I'm just back to another video and today I'll be measuring myself, you know. The reason why I want to make this video is not only I have 400 subscribers, it's also um that I want to review my height and also um, I want to I want to share something about this video about my height, right? Or about everyone's height. Did you know that throughout the day you actually lose about half to one inch, you know? Right? It depends like who you are. Like for female, I heard that they can shrink about like one inch throughout the day. And for males, you know, they can shrink at least half an inch, right? Or if you're like overweight, then you lose like more than half an inch. And if you're skinny, then you lose half an inch. So there's a reason why you lose your height throughout the day. No, the, the, the main reason why you lose your height throughout the day is because, man, because of um, gravity, right? Yeah, because gravity just pull our bone down, you know, making us shorter, you know, throughout the day. Then when you go to sleep, you know, then you regain your inch and then you lose and you regain and you lose. It happens like this every single day. And people don't even notice that they shrink throughout the day because half an inch is not even noticeable, right? So in this video, I got to prove to you that that yes, your height does shrink throughout the day, right? And people are freaking out like, why am I so short in the evening, right? Yeah, the, just watch the video, man. You'll you'll see why you get short toward the end of the day, and then in the um, in the morning you become tall. The reason why you're tall in the morning is because your your body already gets stretched and all that stuff, right? And then um, you haven't done any activity that's making you shorter. But at the end of the day, you know, gravity pull on your bone like after several hours, you know. So, and then you get shorter, shorter, shorter a little bit, right? Yeah, this is like me. This is a similar view like what Rob Paul shows you, right? He's like, this guy's obsessed with height. But I'm going to be showing you the same thing, you know. He also have his point in in view saying that yeah you do get shorter throughout the day so in this video I'll be measuring myself and not gonna lie to you guys that your height does change just like your weight you know you eat and you drink make your weight like fluctuate throughout the day right so anyway I got this here and in this video will prove that exactly how tall I am right I'm pretty nervous to like to measure myself, you know, but I'm, I I think I do know how tall I am because I've measured myself like several times, so I should know my height by now. But this video will prove you exactly how tall I am. So once I measure and use a the pencil, then I get the measuring tape down the stair in the garage and pull up there and then you'll see like how tall I am, right? So this... So comment below that if I'm not standing straight. If I'm not standing straight, then tell me to make another video of me like measuring myself again. If I if I have bad posture or stuff. So yeah, sometimes people don't stand straight. That's why they tend to be shorter because they don't stand straight. So here's how you stand straight. So you lean against the wall. Your eye has to look like this. Has to look straight. Your body has to look straight. Your leg has to be straight. Right. Sometimes people don't stand straight. That's why they're missing out like at least a few inch, right? Few inches. So you have to let me know if I'm staying straight. If I don't stand straight, if you see like if I'm like like slanting like half an inch or a quarter inch, then you got to let me know. Maybe that's why I don't stand straight. Maybe that's why I'm taller than I thought, right? So yeah, it's very important. You need to look out these kind of mistakes. When like measuring people, right? So I get this pencil right here and I'm gonna measure myself. Oh, I need to put this camera towards me, so yep, see, body straight.
Et mon verre. Non, il est mort. Okay, about um, this tall, right? Okay, so I assume that the comments say that I stand straight or I don't stand straight, but this is my official height. If I don't stand straight, then maybe like right here in my stand a little tippy toe, then right here, right? So, yeah, I have to measure myself again, you know. Maybe, maybe, maybe this will make me a little shorter or maybe this will make me a little tall, who knows? So, let's see if there's any difference if you measure from front to back. So, I don't have a person measuring me, but I'm good at measuring by myself as well, so... Looking straight. People say I look straight. Yeah, so it's about this. Actually, I get a little bit higher. Okay, so here it is. So it is exactly at that mark, right? Yeah, so it's, it's exactly at that mark that I'm, I'm about this tall, right? Yeah, so... So, so this is how tall I am, right? So I measure, um... Legitly, no shoes, nothing on. From all the way here, all the way right there, right? And in the evening, I'll really measure myself again to see how much I shrunk. So, peace out, and you'll get to find out how tall I am, you know? And you guys are curious, right? The reason why it's always best to measure your height in the morning because it's very accurate and you're just not gonna shrink at all, right? And you will claim every single inch that you are, right? You're not going to miss any inch. You're not going to miss any centimeter. So, yeah, and I've got the measuring tape right here. This is why, you know, the minute you get out of bed, measure yourself right away. Because throughout the day, you will get shorter and things will become inaccurate. Don't measure high in the evening or afternoon. So, sorry, I don't have a camera holder here, but... I'll measure like how tall this line is so roll this straight roll this straight right Hello oh, YouTubers, um, is the rule straight? I think it's straight, right? You have no bending. Put this thing against the wall. Nah. <laughs> nah. Maybe I put it against the wall, then it'll be like, maybe a few millimeters off, so. Let's see, so I'm quite five foot ten and a half. So, yep. Let's measure here to claim that I am this tall, so... Boom, 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 boom. Slow down. We're about to hit that mark. 
Yep. See, so the ruler is very straight and I'm about, um, you see, about five foot ten and a half. So, yeah. So, um, so you see where the mark is? So the mark measured me at, um, like five ten and like a little bit over five ten and a half. So, technically, this is why, um, okay, so, yeah, five ten and a half. This is why people claim me to be like five foot eleven, right? Yeah, because five ten and a half, five foot eleven, like look almost the same. Like you cannot tell the difference, yeah, because anything like less than an inch, you will look like um short. Like people will not tell the difference if you guys if you like gain like an inch or if there's an inch difference between your height and the other person, so yeah, that's why a lot of people say that I'm like 5'10", 5'11", or 6 feet. Well, most of the time people guess my height is 5'11", or 5'10", mainly because I'm 5'10 and a half, right? So I'm not quite 5'11 yet, so I am I am taller than 5'10". According to the video, people say that I am taller than 5'10", but not quite past 5'11 yet, so... Yeah, so see this mark? It is... Stop saying that I'm 5'11". I am not 5'11". But then, yeah, you see? It, I am 5'11", but not solidly 5'11". Almost 5'11". That mark is almost there, so... Very close, so... I'm just half an inch away from... I'm a little less than half an inch away from, like, 5'11", so... Let's see how tall I am, you know, in the evening, right? Yeah, but because I hate being tall, that's why I want to claim myself to be 5'10 or 5'10 and a half. If I like to be tall, then I would want to claim myself as 5'11, right? For some reason, I hate being tall and I keep thinking I'm 5'9, I keep thinking I'm 5'10, but I'm actually taller than that, right? For some reason, I just keep wanting to be shorter, shorter. So comment below, like, if I should make a video of, like, why I want to be shorter, right? Okay, so right now is um, the time, the last time I recorded this um, view measuring my height, it was, today's the same day, right? So I record around like, um, let's say, um, I record around like 10 minutes after I get up, so I would, it was recorded around like 10 a.m. to 10, 10 a.m. of today of March, um, I forgot, yeah, I forgot to mention it, March something, March 22 of 2019, right? But now, you know, this is four hours later, right? So four hours later, um, I'm gonna remeasure my height again, right? Same exact spot, no different, nothing changed. Same exact location, same distance. So this was my original height. It's about this tall, right? Hopefully I didn't delete my morning video because if I did delete video on accident, then There'll be no proof of how tall I, I was in the morning, and this is my height in the afternoon. So let's go remeasure my height. So GoPro, leave it here, and let's see if I actually shrink or not. So just me stand up straight. Awesome. Yeah, so I have to stand like this. <clears throat> Am I actually this tall? Yep, this is my, let's say, 2 o'clock height. 
<clears throat> now measure back here, just in case I messed up. <clears throat> Get back against the wall. Yep, so also like right here, right? And then I measure right here. Comment below if I'm not standing straight again because I have a hard time staying straight. <sighs> so, um, yeah. So, this is my original height in the morning. Then I went down. See, so there's a so this view proved that I did shrink, right? This is how tall I was in the morning before any activity happened, before any movement happened. But now I'm about this short. The line I'm pointing at, this is my current high and this is was my high in the morning. So it looks like I did shrink at least a quarter inch, right? As you can see, right? The height does fluctuate throughout the day. So yeah, cause if you, let's say you put this cube right here, right? So this is originally by 10 and a half. So guess who's taller, me or that yellow thing? So see, so. I'm not quite as tall as this thing, but in the morning, um, my head hits here, but in the evening, I'm about this tall, right? Don't you get what you, you, you see what I'm saying, right? Because I don't feel my head anymore. Because in the morning, I, my thing will touch this thing, but in the evening, it won't, so. Yeah, so it looks like I did lose at least a centimeter or a quarter of an inch, so. So yeah, so my height is right here, right? Yep, no cheating whatsoever. So yes, yeah, right there now, so let's go really measure this thing. Yeah, it takes me a few minutes just to measure myself because I want to make sure it's really accurate stuff. Yeah, so I'm also obsessed with height too, so how much did I shrink, so... Oh, so I got this thing in, so... Wow, so I'm actually 5'10", uh... <clears throat> Yep. Oh yeah, because the ruler wasn't pushed in, so that's why, um, you know, that's why my height is inaccurate, so it looks like I did shrink half an inch, right? So my original height in the morning was um, 5, 10, 3, 4, and then I shrank to like 5, 10 and a quarter, so. Yeah, so I actually did shrink about half an inch, right? Almost half an inch. I was right, so I did shrink about at least a quarter of an inch, so... Yeah, so, so it's like 5, 10 and a quarter, so... Yeah, because I pushed this ruler all the way in because it was out, that's why the thing looked a little shorter. 
Yeah, so I didn't position my thing correctly because I couldn't push it in, but now I push all the way in. It makes it seem more legit, right? So it was like 5, 10, 3, 4 was my peak height. And then became 5. So I'm still over 5, 10, surprisingly. Right, or if I wasn't sure, so. I thought it was 5, 10 and a half, but then I realized maybe I did brew. Who knows, man? Whew. Yeah, so I'm still above 5 foot 10. I'm still. So, yeah, this is about. Oh, it's about right here, so. Yeah, I'm still taller than it. So, not that bad, huh? So, my. So, so the first time, because in my um, earlier video of today, um, I thought it was by 10 and a half, but then it turns out I'm 5 foot 10 and 3 fourths. That's why a lot of people are saying that I'm 5'11", so I'm actually less than half an inch away from 5'11", so it's not that bad, huh, if you think about it, so. Yeah, the reason why it makes you look short is because um, I put the ruler, I didn't put it all the way in, so it, it looks like it's kind of like tilted and you lose like, a less, like another quarter inch, so. Yeah. My bad, YouTubers. Um, I made a mistake there and, you know, just ignore that part. So, I remeasure myself and, and yeah, and I'm actually, um, yeah, so this mark was right. So, I am 5 foot 10 and a half, not 5, 10, 3, 4, because that would be scary if I grew another quarter inch after my 20. So, yeah, so my height is right now, you know, yeah, I think because if I push this roll all the way in and if this, like, if this great thing stuck inside the wall, it actually makes you a little bit taller, right? Yeah, because I'm standing on the rug and this rug is above. This rug is above this thing, so it gives you another quarter inch. So it's cheating like another quarter inch. So I'm sorry I messed you guys up. Yeah, because I don't do too much of the measuring video. This is why um, I make mistakes, you know. And sometimes I could could um, not staying up straight. This is why I make mistake. I do want to make an apology that I send this video a little longer. Yeah, hit the dislike button if if I make a little silly mistake, right? I should just measure this thing on the rug because I'm staying on the rug. I should not like pull all the way the ruler down to cheat my height, right? So yeah, so I was originally um. So yeah, my mark is right here. Yep, the ruler straight and um, yeah, so it's actually five foot ten point. So yeah, I'm a little bit above five ten, like one sixteenth of an inch taller than five ten. So we'll see like how tall I was in the evening. So yeah, so this is my height right here, and then I shrunk. So I shrunk like almost half an inch, but yeah, almost. So as you can see, right? So still like a film a film millimeter like above five foot ten. Not like a quarter inch. So I think stuck, so see you in another four hours. I think around like seven or eight, I'll remeasure myself again and see if I'm getting any smaller, right? Yeah, so this is four hours later. I already lost like half an inch. Pretty insane guys like i said because i just ran like five miles if you look at my previous video and so it impact your bone really hard because i ran hard the ends so you should check out my five my five minute five mile run and i ran like a like around 33 something minutes so you should go check that out for yourself Okay, so welcome back by so I just wait for like another like six to like seven hours later and the last time I measured my height was around like two something, right? But now it's like it's like past eight o'clock right now as of right now, so Yep, sorry man the camera died so this is why it takes me a while to like put this video out and I want to wait very late at night to see 
how many, like how many centimeters, how many inch that I shrink in total, right? So I'm pretty sure that I shrink at least a quarter inch, right? Because from like 10 to 2 o'clock, I, sh I shrunk like nearly half an inch. Not completely half an inch, but nearly half an inch. So I'm going to remeasure myself to see like where's my head is at, where my height is. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm the same. Maybe I got a teeny bit shorter. But yeah, probably not another half an inch. So let's go see like if I shrink or not. And I'll tell you how much. So stay tuned. Be patient. Let's go measure. So here. I think the way I stand, you know, maybe doesn't make me that tall, but think about measure uh, this way. So I'm staying very straight, you know, no hunching, no tippy toeing, flat foot. You see how straight I am? I'm really straight right now and my neck is straight and my eyes are so straight. Okay, so yes, yeah, so okay. Oh, make sure this thing is standing straight. So it looks like I did shrink again, right? So I made a total of three marks in a day, right? So this is was my height at 10 a.m., right? 10 a.m. I was this tall. 2 p.m. I was uh, this tall, and then I shrunk a little bit more. So it looked like I did shrink another, like I think, like an eighth of an inch, right? So let's see how tall that is. So. I'm guessing maybe I'm exactly 5'10 right now, maybe a little under 5'10, maybe 5'9.9 inches, so I cannot believe that I am like almost, I'm like nearly 5'11 in the morning and I shrink down to like under 5'10, it's like this is ridiculous. Yeah, like I said man, some people, you know, just on their bad days or just bad posture or like, just like Back, like combination of like bad of everything on bad days and stuff and bad posture or just have or just look tired you probably gonna shrink like almost an inch but I don't think you can shrink more than an inch I mean it doesn't make any sense not unless you get old or something like that so <sighs> this will speak for the truth so let's remeasure it again oh but first now I get the ruler so I'll, I'll explain the end like how much I shrink so this is why I get this like this good ruler so not so important now. Let's go measure how tall I am. Oh not so bad. So I'm a So I'm exactly five foot ten. Hey, hey camera, bring a little closer here. Oh sorry, no cameraman. So I'm exactly five foot ten. I'm exactly just right in the evening, man. So I thought I would be under five foot nine, but yeah, cause I think around two p.m. I'm like five foot ten point. I'm like five foot ten one eighth, but then I lost an eighth of an inch, and there you go, guys. There's my evening height. This is my height before I go to bed. So see, so it hit exactly. 5 foot 10.
So, yeah, so that's right, man. Okay, let's make it from far away. Get my hand out of the way. No shadows. Yep, the shadow's still there, but... Yeah, so this is how tall I was. I was like literally right here, and then I shrunk all the way to right here. So I shrink like more than half an inch. Like I said, man, yeah, because I run pretty hard today for five miles. I mean, if I do like hard activity stuff, you're going to lose like an additional like eighth of an inch. So, yep. There you go, guys. So, yeah, so it's exactly five for ten. I'm exactly... So, so yeah, so let me make a recap of the shrinkage of the day. So in the morning, I was 5 foot 10, point like 5 eighth, and then I shrink like nearly half an inch. I actually did shrink half an inch, so I became like 5 foot 10 and 1 eighth, and then in the evening, I shrink another eighth of an inch. And that will do for the day, so... They say that it takes approximately like 10 or 12 hours to like get to like your basic height. So by the end of the day, so you don't lose at least half an inch. So in this case, for me, I lose like 5 eighths of an inch. So I did not lose an inch. So I'm happy there. So thank God, man, that would be scary. So I don't think my height will ever will never go under 5 foot 10, but maybe it will. Yeah, so this is just on a regular day. Someday I maybe stand like maybe five foot nine point three fourth. So this, so the lowest mark. So, so what a coincidence, man! I hit exactly five foot ten. So, peace out here, and I hope you like this video. And be sure to share with your friends, and hope I gain subscriber because of this, man. So, this do something new for this channel, you know. I gotta do new stuff. Can I do the same old thing? So that way I can get more likes and more com and more nice comments. So peace out.